This is, I mean, this is an amazing thing that you come at this first phrase and, and you're just off and running. <laughs> oh my gosh. Can you set up the scene a little bit for us about okay. what's, so, where she is? In <clears throat> my husband is gone. Uh, he's a clock, uh, he repairs clocks, okay? And so that's the only day in the week uh, during which I'm by myself and I can see my lovers. And <laughs> I'm hiding them into clocks because I have two lovers in the house. Uh, right now there is one in my room and I'm downstairs and the other one is hidden in the other clock. <laughs> but, As you do, yeah. <laughs> but both of them were incapable of satisfying me. One is talking about poultry and the other one is so fat he couldn't get out of the clock. <laughs> so I'm there and I haven't get laid and <laughs> I'm mad. Yeah. Very. <laughs> and at the very end, the, all this play-out music is you yeah. destroying. Destroying things. And yeah. <laughs> Do not mess with a woman. <laughs> um, okay, this is, what, what I love is right from the very beginning too, you were, I felt very much like we knew who the character was and you were doing gesture and doing it well. I feel like I still want it to come from a deeper place. You know, and the other thing is, I want to feel like, especially on these Rolandando, as you go aventure, that it becomes ah, oh, that kind of. Oh, I want that kind of color coming into it. You do this great sort of wail on the top, of this sort of scream on the top, and it needs to carry down all the way to the lower. I think in the lower voice, we just want it to speak a little yes. bit more. Do you know what I mean? Yes. It brings the sex in. Mm -hmm. And I want to find also, this is, I mean, this is an aria that I don't know so well, it's so new, but what I want to see is where this slow boil can go. Mm -hmm. So she's just kind of to where the point where she explodes. Mm -hmm. So that you have to find the dramatic pacing in this so that it builds somewhere. Yeah. And I want to feel again like it's coming, it, it was all a little bit here. Yes. You know, when you're, you, your kind of go-to place is like, ah, which is great. But I wonder if it can also be like, ah, 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 you know what I mean? And I'm not sure exactly technically what that's going to be. I just want to play with you and see if we can find a, a bigger arc to the piece. So maybe the opening is a great explosion, but every time 
more dynamic contrast. So when it's really piano, uh -huh. you know, he gives you so much. Ravel gives, there's no decisions to really make. But all fortes up there don't have to be the same. Okay. And maybe it's a forte because you've got tremendous, beautiful, amazing power up there. It's gorgeous. But at some points, can it grow? Mm -hmm. Can it go, can it arch in a different way into the descending passage? Yes. So right now, you're giving me always the ah, oh, da 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 da. Oh, you know, that kind of, oh, it's been a week. It's been two weeks, and there's been nobody here. And I'm like, oh, that's my horrible French accent. I do a really bad Scottish accent, too. It's, all, it's embarrassing. <laughs> Okay, so really, the, and this is little girl gesture. This is, the nerve was it man? Something a little bit more, right? A little bit more contained, so that when you do make that kind of gesture, it's built into that. It's it's grown into that. We don't start there. Make sense? So it's a low simmer. It's a low boil. Feel it. Yeah, great. When you finish, nature, you kind of come off of a little bit. Really, fin nature. So it's we've got an exclamation point yes. of that. All the end phrases, you're backing off a little bit, and I want you to draw. You know, the nerve. Anybody need to wait? You know, so we want that drive to that exclamation point. Okay. Punctuation is also, again, not magic. Punctuation gives you so much information. There's an exclamation point at the end of that. There's an exclamation point at the end of an aventure, the opening phrase. So you can't dissipate it into nothing. You've got aventure. Whew. I mean, it's not good French, but you know what I mean? So that you've got that, we feel that exclamation. Yeah, that was Victor Borga, right? Yeah, thank you. We want Victor Borga on that, okay? How'd the opening feel? Good. Good? It Try it. No, it's not better. We're just playing to see if... No, if... I mean, was I like... I liked that, but I, I love on the first phrase that you hit it right out of the box the way you did the first time. Okay. Later, Later. change it, make it more curvy, more... So we don't always know what's coming. But I, I, I love that you hit it, because you can. Yeah. Maybe not everybody can do that, that you bam right from the beginning. It's okay. shocking. It's great. Yeah. And so this is heavy out of frustration. Mm -hmm. This is boiling out of frustration. <laughs> so it doesn't need to go here. It needs to go here. It's that, right? And then you're going to let it go somewhere okay don't read into anything about that <laughs> can i can i just try something again this is going into vocal thing and i just throw it out here can you say ture, just speak it ture. Uh, speak a ture. Ture. Yeah, so when you go down there, don't try and sing that pitch. Mm -hmm. Don't try and make sound. Okay. Speak it. So, I'm kind of speaking, I'm kind of singing. So don't try and make sound, which will kind of blow it out yeah. a little bit. And just try and go into, on the E and the D, just sort of go into a speaky place. Like you're singing or more speaking? Half. Half. Go more speaking. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, that's kind of belting. <laughs> then I think. Yeah, how's that feel? Speaking. 
Yeah, mm -hmm. it's easy. It shouldn't, it shouldn't be any trying to, don't try and make sound there, but let it go to speaky. So I, I don't know if it's chest, if it's mixed, whatever, mm -hmm. but it's, it's that, I, th I know when I'm in that range, if I try and make sound, it that's kind of blows yeah. out. Mm -hmm. And that's kind of, I, I feel like it doesn't get thing. But if you try and do that, that's not what we want either. I'm kind of just speaking right there, yeah. but I can also turn it into singing there. Mm -hmm. And it's gonna be more sound than trying to make, yeah. sing it. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. Just play around with that. That's just kind of a technical thing. Sure. Don't, you know, th think about that on your O time. Okay, inside, right here, right from the beginning. This is where it's boiling. Start with your hands on your hips if you want. You've done that a couple times and then you stop yourself. Start it. Okay. Go. back to this pitoyable yeah. aventure. <laughs> so the first time really singing it and then next time you come you're we're repeating it you're are you more disgusted? Are you what what I think she's for, I think in the beginning she's like how could this happen to me? I'm so yeah. sexy, so beautiful. Right. And then she's like oh, she's really getting mad about it, I feel. Like, she's getting mad at who? Because you're going to have it another time. That's number two. I think the, the high A is like, she's really desperate. Like, really, am I going to spend my whole day like this? Yeah. So this one is, is what? Because are you mad at them? Are you mad at this husband? Are you mad at you? Did you do something wrong? What I'm sorry, I want you to get really specific yes. about what that is. And then it will take on a different life of its own. I mean, I think I'm mad at them. Like, why would it be my fault? Yeah. Like, I think that's Stupid men. <laughs> He's so fat, he can't get out of the claw. Oh, pitoyable aventure. So the first one is this really great vocality. Technically, when you have an aria like this and you're doing an audition, you need to establish the voice. Just Let's just be clear about that. You can have the emotion in there that helps. That's really great. But this is right out of the gate. You make sure it's there. Now, you've had a page to warm up. Second phrase needs to have a different color. And it's the way he's written it. La pitoyable aventure. I mean, no offense, but it's that French. You know, it's that really go there, you know, and, let the, and let's see if we find a different color that, okay? So this is the second one, yeah. So look at the look at the at the dynamics here. Mezzo yeah. piano crescendo decrescendo mm -hmm. piano. Mezzo forte. Yes. Okay, so we this is where we're going to get all the color and the characterizations mm -hmm. really being true when a con, a composer is being this specific in what he wants, do it. We're kind of obligated. Not that there's a Ravel police, but we're kind of obligated. Yeah. How did that phrase feel? Good. I think so. Yeah. It feels more like different. You feels know, different. Like, oh, more yeah. Simple. Yeah. And it's great and we feel more disgust and frustration yeah. on your part and, and it it's makes us listen because we don't exactly know what's coming. Mm -hmm. So after the uh, aventure, the très long, yeah. and really go into these, that and that. Hmm. Right. All of a sudden, you're making a list of things, yeah. but with all those dynamic contrasts, it comes out in a different way. The other thing I'll ask you, you sound angry on each one of those. Yeah. Is it possible that maybe um, the Espanol, ya, the Estramio Dur, is, maybe that one was a little fun? Yes, this is fun. This is maybe fun. that was, hmm, that wasn't bad. <laughs> but he, you know, then he left so quickly. Yeah. You know, I mean, so each one of those also has a different memory associated mm -hmm. to it. 
Doña Sol is from Hernani. Estramadur has a place in yeah. Spain. So maybe that's... I want you to have a different... Okay. Uh, instead of the same gesture on each one of those. Sure. A different association with it. point out what's happening here everything's happening in the voice mm -hmm. we don't need movement yeah mm -hmm. you're not you can do it you can absolutely do it but everything's coming alive through the text and the and the color yeah. okay when singers are really this is what I feel when I'm sort of going all things are in a good zone for me it doesn't always happen when it does I don't feel like I'm singing I feel like I'm painting I feel like a painter more than a singer so it's color of vowel, it's color and speed of breath, which is the brush stroke. It's the way you're using the consonants. Yeah. So the difference between pitoyable avant tout and pitoyable avant tout, it's a totally different universe of mm -hmm. color and thing. So let's go on and let's just keep okay. that, keep it really vibrant and alive through the dynamics and text. <laughs> Legato, really connected. Did you feel that? Yes. We like that. We like that, right? And all of a sudden, your character starts coming to life in a real way. Yeah. It's frustration, it's thing, anger, it's release, it's all this kind of stuff. It's not just vocality. Mm -hmm. Are you getting? Yes, I am. Yeah, yeah, you are, because that was amazing. Um, are we okay on time? Yeah, let's just keep going for... Mm -hmm. No, I want, I want to hear that one more time with that amazing legato. That was gorgeous. Top of 78? Okay, awesome. Do you, that is coming to life in such a vivid, amazing way. You sang it beautifully the first time too, and you already were doing a lot. Mm -hmm. This just takes it to the next level. And it's all of a sudden, it's, um, yeah, it's the next level, which is really exciting, you know? Okay, when you go here, bong, 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 it's clocks, yes. but it's also internal here for you. It's always, it, what does it mean? What do those chimes mean? Other than it's almost, he's almost home. He's coming back, yeah. I mean, but, maybe, how do you say, biological clock? Yes, I, yeah, <laughs> that's what I was going to say. You're getting older, too. Mm -hmm. Marshall and ding, 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 <laughs> the time is going. And, and so either it's, it, it doesn't, it's going to be tough going forward because the pressure is now on. The clocks are thing. Time is going mm -hmm. in many ways. Yeah. So let's just see where this goes. So different color. You're in a different place now than you were on the first three pages. Yeah. Fidel, oh, ah, okay. yeah, faithful and pure. Not, even faithful. Not faithful and pure, but faithful and, oh, <laughs> the and is awful, right? <laughs> but you're doing these triplets, which are so great. Pay even more attention to the harmony that's ha happening mm -hmm. under you, okay? Thank really, you the harmony. Mm -hmm. I want you to sing into the harmony yeah. more. So this is a really important thing. We often pay only attention to the melody, okay? 
sing into the harmony on this kind of stuff. Actually, everything, I think. That's the key. So it's not just a line that is disconnected from the harmony. It is a part of it. You're making that harmony happen. Okay? Maintenant. And something a little rounder, something a little bit more internal. Maintenant. Everything's been external, exploding outward. Now go in with it. It's mezzo piano. Uh -huh. It's still mezzo piano. So all of that, uh, put it in the consonants, yeah. but mezzo piano. Because the next one's forte, we want a big difference. Mm -hmm. Two totally different things that way. Piece. Oh, amazing. But here's, it's awesome. It's awesome. But that, that whole panic. And the whole thing, all you have to do, again, same kind of theme. It's coming up through the feet. All we need to do is see your eyes. It's like, do you ever seen the movie Carrie? <laughs> it's a little bit dating myself. She was this, um, it, rent the movie, because it's the prom scene at the end, right? And she slams the doors closed with her thing. It's, it's, everything is with the eyes. She's men, hap, making it happen te telepathically. And so there's no arm, there's no this, it's just boom, 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 boom. So when we, when we hear the destruction happening, it's got to be right there in your eyes. So all you have to do is hold it. You don't have to do anything. You have to hold it. But that thing, dure, 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 ah, and that's all you need. Does this, how we work it, does that make sense? It makes so much sense. I mean, really, you bring it and it's already really polished and really great. This is just about refining and going back to the source, re-examining. Oh, actually, oh, God, that phrase is piano there. I'm really, I'm mezzo forte the whole time. Because what happens is it becomes alive. Yes. And you make us listen. And the character becomes more... Uh, organic, more real. Okay. Makes sense? Yes. Beautiful. Thank it's a you. great piece for you. Thank you. Yeah. Bravo. Okay.